All right. We got the six and five Pacers versus the six and five Clippers. It looks like Mel Daniels rebounding pace has slowed down tremendously, but he's still leading the team. Uh, and the Clippers, Bob McAdoo seems to be doing it all for them. Uh, Chris Paul, though, has been doing a great job facilitating. They've made some lineup changes, and they've actually managed to bounce back a little bit. Pacers have been a little up and down. Um, Clippers drafting Daryl Chapman, who's been a very promising rookie for them. The Pacers uh, drafting a lot of people who are going to strengthen their bench. Their bench looks better than ever, um, and they're hoping with the extra depth they can actually have a positive record this year and make the playoffs. Both of these teams actually wanting to make the playoffs for the first time in this series. Uh, so both of these teams have, have a lot to play for. I think, though, at home, uh, Clippers probably take this one. Welcome to the weekend, everybody. Let's get it going with NBA action on 2K Sports. This is Kevin Harlan okay. with Greg Clippers. Anthony and Doris Burke. Also Ooh. joining us Ooh, okay. from the sidelines, okay. David Lamar Aldridge. Odom. We'll see the Indiana oh, okay. Pacers and the Los Angeles Lamar Odom's Clippers. running the offense? Let's check out hmm. Indiana's starting lineup. Sabonis is out there with Paul George. Yeah, say that's Miller oh, wow. Daniels in at the five. Reggie Miller pulling up from three. Doesn't get it to go. That's, that's rare in it. this league. Lamar Odom, though, man. Not on drugs. His potential is unlimited, right? And Bosch now top of the key. There's Miller with the three. <laughs> wow. Reggie missing bad to open things up. But... <laughs> Mel Daniels able to. <laughs> Get his back there. No doubt. Lamar Odom now here's Odom. running the offense. Oh, it's crazy. And now the latest from our reporter, David Aldridge. Hey, Kevin, I caught up that's with that's so weird. Coach. The Clippers must have a, a game plan a around put up points in a hurry. Lamar Odom he said they need to put forth a great effort defensively to prevent I mean, to have him be consistently running the offense. And stay hot. Let's see who wins the battle of wills here tonight. DA, thanks for that update, guys. What can they do to prevent a barrage doing? of points to start this game? I think one thing they have to do is stay oh, connected Reggie. to shoot. Mm. Obviously, though, if he gets his defender said, to sag then, off even right. a half a step, easy looks, especially at the rim he's going to fire from the three-point line. Here's Paul. After I like what. Oh, I like what the Clippers have done with this new lineup. Putting, you, the uh, putting Odom in over Blake Griffith. Blake Griffin. Reggie. Um, hey, okay, he missed his like first two little this. warm up shots. Okay. Early, and he's now he cooking. Yeah, I like. I think Lamar does more to open up the floor the offensively and for people like Kawhi spot, and Daryl Chapman. And they play really big. So, no um, fighting through the pick, no rotation. He's like, play down low. Oh, man. Mm. Blows, bucket is good, and he'll have a chance at the line to make it a three This Pacers team, line. though, I mean, and, and that's why it's so important to really be you know, some bonus and Mel Daniels, maybe a little undersized, but first approaching uh, played. You know, they, they've been eating on the boards. They they actually set really great screens. They got this like, nice little cheeky play where they do double screens. And George and Miller are open on both sides. And, uh, mm. Miller outside. And Indiana, another three. Man, he's having quite the and, uh, yeah, you get You get Paul George and Reggie Miller open <laughs> from beyond the arc. There's Indiana Pacers squad. It's pretty much going down. Good work on Chris Paul, though, to return the favor. It's like, I mean, even when you have also two, like Paul George and Reggie Miller, even part of the screen setting, that's makes a huge difference. Paul George. And he he's right dangerous in the passing play, lanes. He the steals a ball yeah, in transition. The he's was there. The hustle deadly. Was there. Very close to picking that one. Now here's Paul. 
He's got six. Oh, George and Kawhi Leonard. That's probably going to be the matchup to watch. Six really. to shoot. Mm. Who, who can do the most for their team out of those two? The shooter guys to be left open like that. The defense just dodged a bullet there. Daniels kicks to George. Ooh. And it's George finishing it up. That's a play that's all about positioning. Paul George that has the elevation. Nasty. Nice little pump fake. Here's Leonard. Nice pass. Nice catch. And a resounding dunk. Well, he's such a good athlete for a center. It's how he's going to go back and forth here. Might be one of the smallest fives in the NBA. There's Miller with the three. Rebounded by Mockadoo. Great rebound by Bob over Mel Daniels. Leonard with the ball. And it's blocked. Ooh. Way to stay with it. Be patient. And here's Sabonis. Oh, that's a bucket. A wide open look. <laughs> I mean, even Sabonis fading, bro. I, I so will always be more shocked well, at a miss from Reggie Miller again, and he is than, than a make. That's for here's sure. <laughs> And that one clearly a foul. Gets the whistle and two shots coming up. You can see the kind of savvy Kawhi Leonard plays with. This guy makes the defense commit and gets himself to the foul line. And guys, what do you think about the offensive approach so far that we've seen for the Pacers? <laughs> Absolutely dialed in from beyond the arc so far in this one. The defense is surrendering the long-range shot here early on. Yeah, and what an excellent display of passing in the early stages of this game. A good deal of their points coming directly off quality passes. Outside, George. Oh, George. The kick out to Bosch. Kick out to Bosch. That three off the mark. Clippers trailed by three. He put that effort kind of deep. Oh, that was Reggie Miller, though, I would have said. Oh, I mean, come on. The war Odom throwing the lob. That's something Lake ain't doing, man. Lake always trying to be on the receiving end of the ball. George, I hear Lamar, Lamar throwing it. George passes to Bosch. And then Bosch <laughs> with the top. A little artistry in the painted area converting against the size. <laughs> Some guys just relish oh the challenge. Oh, my goodness. Find a way, and he does. Awesome rewind courtesy of the AT&T 5G Slam Camp. And here is Los Angeles now. Following the score by Indiana. Paul kicks it to Odom. Fades and shoots. Chapman's shot is off. I think this is a spot he has got to become oh more my consistent. Goodness. You want to command mm. the defender's respect. Yeah, now taking it to the rack time rack here. with power. Rightfully down so. The two-hand slam. George is checked in for Leonard. And Pacers the Clippers going decide to take line. their first Hunt time out from here. Lewis Bosch was and here is Los fat it. now. It's a five-point game. You know, let's try to, try to take a timeout. Ball stop their George. momentum. Hmm. Oh, Pacers with the rebound. Yeah, Paul George coming in for Kawhi now. Sabonis so now it's the Paul George on Paul George. To the inside. And Reggie Miller is actually working down low. Daryl Chapman. Move. And they pick mm. up two. I like Miller's that little turnaround. Yeah, that was the third straight high percentage look. Yeah, he's got 14 points on the night, man. He's been cooking. Got to start putting bodies on bodies. Here's Chapman. No points. He thought about it, but he, he realized he was deep. Oh, good and Paul gets the assist. But I like the extra pass there. Paul's got his third assist on the night. Well, when you have now a Reggie's like calling the George, shots. Hey, he is the hot hand feeding, you know. Hey, just catch offense. He's capable. They get the rebound. Oh, well, yeah, Odom, though, with the rebound in. Their work on the board, Coming back, Kevin, it's actually particularly here had a little to bit start like, the game. Like five more four the opportunity ball. there. They have to go for the reset. The dish to George. And Paul George Fires is putting that up. Deep. That's a bucket. And again, Los Angeles <laughs> with the triple. Yeah, that's, you know, Paul that's, George has been You can tell just by the way he left the ground. <laughs> on that jump. It was clean. Else. Daniels dishes to George. Oh. And the Paul George trying Odom. to get back at Paul George. But Odom's got four rebounds in this game. Pulls up. Oh. That one off oh, Bob McAdoo almost, well, almost had that offensive the putback. Gives him that shot next time. Reggie they trying to take it into the, the trees. Still the manages to get the rebound. Okay. And now they reset Flash like it didn't happen. Around. Oh, and oh, Chris Paul steal, though. 
Chris Paul, this has to be. I was going to say it was going to be an oop, but he took it all the way. He's trying to get an and one, and now we're going to see some substitutions for sure. Paul George has been. Oh, oh, they're going to platoon swap for Indiana. Okay. And now uh, Paul George is staying out there for the Clippers, but everyone else. Has been subbed here, so and Malone with the rebound. And here's Malone. Now you can see, I mean, hey, the Clippers have strengthened their bench this year. Good on the triple. They've made some changes. The bench looks a little more fluid. Give him some credit. Pacers bench, I mean, this they look better than ever. So timeout yeah, called here, the first you know, hey, Pacers are going to take a timeout here. I mean, they went from a three-point lead to a five-point deficit real quick. You don't want this home crowd to get into it too soon. Let's see, you know, okay, bench versus bench here. Let's see what we can make happen. O'Neal inside. Pacers are pretty confident with a better starting five. And they're beginning to just flat out fall apart. Let's see who has the better bench. Especially on the interior. On the wing, Crazy George. enough to say that Pacers are probably bigger down low. And the Clippers off, off the bench. The jump hook. He can't hit that job. And no, Indiana will come the other way. defend that. Against but I think that on the bench, the Clippers have the better the Los Angeles Clippers coming to this one after the win against the Kings. Pass to Porter. Punch to get it to Malone and dies. Oh, yeah. Malone on. <laughs> Good for the best. Malone there. One for one with that shot. Big mismatch down. Low. Hammering away at him inside, forcing the ball into the paint. John Malone. Here's O'Neal. That one wide left. <laughs> I feel like because they didn't actually put rankings there, the Clippers moving the ball around. He's not doing too hot. It's the release. Ooh. Oh, good to go. Chuck Person. And so here is. You're not, not going to play no soft D. Some tough offensive sets. Down low. They want to turn it around. Yeah, right now you just need a bucket to get some momentum. I like the movement from this Pacers. Pass to Wallace. Bench. Person with a screen on Porter. Just five to shoot. Ranger I love making outside. that extra pass. Good. And, mm. it's and of course, it's, it's money. Now, Victor Oladipo's passing skills probably unappreciated. This guy is very unselfish course, and capable. Money. Here's Griffin. Makes it off the glass. Yeah. Griffin's got five. Well, we've seen that movie a few times, haven't we? An easy they get the bench, man. The to be honest, he, he is a person that and it's Paul George he can put a bit of a scoring load on. And I think he's better the, the more shots he takes, rejection. the better he is. So he's probably better than some the bench. There. He take Just more shots timing. and not really take away from any of Swap that one away. On defense, the Clippers. They lead by four. Against Wallace. Eight away. Oh, that's a mm. so far. Both that's a Jermaine O'Neal special the right there. You gotta love it. Well, you love it when you can get off to a fast start. All right, Clippers won the tip off. They got a two for one opportunity here. Three passes to Malone. Outside for George. And again, mm. it's the Clippers from deep. Right now, they're making the most of it already with three points here. If they can hold the Pacers to nothing. Maybe take up a lot of the clock. They can end. He dishes it to Wallace. Possession and uh, it's hauled in by the Clippers. There we go. I mean, yeah, basically eight second difference between shot clock and game clock. So from them, I run it all the way down. Oh, deep. Mm. Or you just take the three. The three and three, and then you held the pace to zero. Just reliable guys. He's so that's a six zero. Right swing play. right there. The pass to person. And the Pacers mm -hmm. have okay. another three. Even still though, 6 3, and, and you give yourself nine, nine seconds nine. on the Both clock. They kind of played it perfectly. The floor. Put the well, ball in Paul George's hand, let him get a step back three. Oh my goodness. A 9 to 3 run here in the last minute of the first, putting up 43 points on the Pacers here at home. I don't foresee the Pacers being able to get back into this. 
I think this is an easy dub for the Clippers at home. Oh, oh, and it, and it was. Uh, not only could the Pacers not get back in it, they fell apart, only scoring a total of 105 points. That first quarter was an offensive shootout. Second quarter, I guess they kind of maybe maybe retired. After half, uh, it was definitely closer. And the fourth, <laughs> despite going 0% from beyond the arc, the Clippers still managed to hold the Pacers to 26 points and, and not get outscored in that fourth quarter, which is um, kind of hard to fathom. Uh, you look at the game overall, while both teams didn't shoot that great, from beyond the area, actually shot pretty poorly. Uh, the Clippers managed to still be consistent, you know, inside the arc, still managed to get to the line. They made the extra passes. They won the battle on the reborn uh, on the rebounds. Um, they were able to win the turnover battle as well. Their bench, I mean, a 22 point deficit in the game. Uh, you look at the bench points, 20 point difference there. You know, the Clippers owe a big portion of this win to their bench. Let's go check out the box score and see exactly how much here. Hey, Reggie was, oh, bro, he dropped 25. You know, Paul George had 15. I mean, 6 of 13, 1 of 4, not what you want to see. Maybe you want to see him with, with you know, five, six more points um, than what he had. But honestly, not nothing crazy. Case and Wallace. You know, very efficient. Lewis Bosch, though, I mean, yeah, 4 of 11, 0 of 3 from the on the arc. I mean, he's got to do something else. Um, but it's like Sabonis had double digit rebounds. Mel Daniels had nine rebounds uh, and four blocks. You know, dude, absolutely eight. But then it's like, look at the bench, man. Everyone just fell apart. Two of seven, one of seven. You know, zero points <laughs> from. Don Boosie. So, I mean, yeah, that, you know, that makes a difference. Uh, meanwhile, Paul George off the bench, eight with 21 points, went five of 10 from beyond the arc. You could tell as soon as he got subbed in, he looked like he was going to be dangerous. But then Pop McAdoo putting up an epic double double, 20 points, 20 rebounds. Uh, that's insane, folks. <laughs> um, like, that's truly insane. Chris Paul not missing a single shot from beyond the arc. Uh, Lamar Odom also with a double-double with 14 points and 10 rebounds. Um, so, I mean, yeah, when they won the Battle of the Boards, they they dominated the Battle of the Boards. Didn't matter that Kawhi was 0-6 from beyond the arc and 5-15 of overall. He managed to still play phenomenal defense with three steals. And... Everyone else was able to step up and, and get those extra boards, right? It didn't really matter that he was missing those shots. And then Blake Griffith, 5 of 7 off the bench. Malone, 5 of 8. Uh, World Be Free with 8 assists off the bench. You know, everyone did their part. But a big portion of this has to go to Lamar Odom and Bob McAdoo, both going double-digit rebounds. It's absolutely phenomenal. 